Hey guys, welcome to my channel. Thank you for joining me. Today I'm doing a memory spread in my B6 print impression for the week of Valentine's Day using this really cute little bee kit from Two Little Bees. I will be pulling in my daughter's jamming. I will be pulling in this washi from Simply Watercolor Co. These date covers from Sadie Stickers and these headers from Cozy Paper Co. I am pulling in these little tiny date dots from Adorably Amy Design. And I don't really mind that they're so small. Uh, it's less important for me to see the date in my memory spread than it is my plan ahead. I like for that to be more bold. I may end up changing that bottom washi for this pocket post that I pulled in because I'm kind of not liking right now how it looks. But once I lay down the full boxes and there's a lot of pink, I may change my mind. This week of Valentine's Day was so busy for me. Did you all get something good? I was happy with what I got. Stacy got, um, me, sent me some roses at work and also sent Landry some roses and balloons. Cause you know, she goes to work with me and does her homeschooling there. So that was really nice. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and lay my full boxes down and let's see which one I want on Valentine's Day. I'm thinking this one. I'll have to excuse my nails. They need painted. Let's see. I like the black and white box too. I think I'm gonna cut it up and use it as washi. just tore that. Well, if I hadn't put one on Valentine's Day already, I could have put that one there and used that to mark the Happy Valentine's Day. Such a pretty box. I hate that it ripped. Okay, I'm so extremely frustrated with my lighting. I know it may look um, 
a little darker like overall but I think it's going to be less of a glare and I don't know if it's just this gold that she has um or if it's just gold in general or if it's just because my head hurts today but um the glare is just really strong so I'm trying to adjust the lighting so that the glare isn't so bad so I did change up my full boxes I did change up the bottom washi um, with the frustration with the lighting and um, how the spread was looking I was just I was about ready to scrap it and sorry I do have white out now on my hands because of that um, bottom washi because I white it out underneath it that's crooked but I can straighten it up um, So I did get my computer back from the IT guy. I had to t put it, um, give it to the IT guy. He actually came and picked it up, but give it to the IT guy on Friday. And he picked it up on, I mean, and he brought it back to me on Monday. Okay, I think I'm gonna work like um, from the top and bottom. for my spacing and let's see I did pull my icons this week so hopefully that'll make things smoother I won't have to flip through as many pages so much trouble sleeping um, on this night like I I mean I just got a couple of hours I kind of I think I'm gonna wait for I put the icon down because I'm not sure what side it's gonna need to be on okay then up at the top I want to mark my steps and that I did do 15 minutes of Pilates and dance like I did some dance um, videos on YouTube Matt Stefanina I know I've mentioned him before but I he um, he has like a dance studio and I like watching him and he's got tutorial videos and it's a really good workout. So in the mark, I got 7,500 steps that day. Oh, I don't know why I'm struggling so much tonight with this. I'm gonna put this washi down here. And then one of these boxes from Simply Watercolor Co. to mark filming my haul. I am not sure where this camera icon came from. It was in my leftover sticker book. And then here's that munchkin talking about it is so dang cute I just thought it was a good fit because it's like sitting up all right let me start Tuesday with marking that I was so tired um, Tuesday was not a great day it was cold and rainy I did not sleep good so I was so extremely tired
let's see. I'm going to use this munchkin holding the coffee cup going, ugh. <laughs> to mark that I was so tired this day. And it was cold and rainy. Oh. I think I'm just going to lay this down here by itself. I had a terrible headache too and I'm going to use a pill bottle from GP Sticker Studio. To mark just that my head hurt all day which of course because I was tired. Let's see what else I wanted to mark. I did order some $2 Tuesday stuff. Alright, I am going to mark the things that I ordered. Um, Crafts by Towie, her wonderful icons. On $2 Tuesday, and then I also ordered from Planning World. And I ha actually have it marked in my notes that I ordered from Planning World on Thursday. I'm not sure why I didn't order from her on... Tuesday because I got some, you know, icons. So, I, but I'm just going to work on both on the same day so that I don't have to take up um, room on a different day. And if I ordered anything else, I did. I also ordered from Harriet Wright Design on Wednesday. Let's see. I think I'm going to have room to mark something else too. All right, so I wanted to fit in on one of these days, counting down to Jason Aldean. So I'll use that space for that. And then, let's see how tall this is. good there. Alright, this is a little big, but I think it'll be okay. So I'm going to sneak my weight in there. There we go. Wednesday was such a much better day. Like, I felt rested. I had energy. Um, and I'm cutting down one of these long flags from the kit just because I want to mark that it was a good day. It's nice to look back and see good days. So I'm just going to use this little area to put that it was a good day, that I felt rested, I had a good night's sleep, um, and I was in a good mood which is always nice. All right, I'm gonna mark that I went to the gym at lunch. I only did um, 15 minutes of cardio, but I also tanned. Um, and just the discipline of going makes me feel um, proud because I'm, tr I'm working on self-discipline because I struggle with it. And I'm going to use this cute sports bra, bra from um, The Giving Girl to mark that. I don't like how that looks at all. I'm definitely going to change that. All right, I'm going to mark going to the gym with, uh, I was going to say this box, but that still looks a lot like that box. It'll be okay. I'm tired of overthinking it. And 
and I'm going to use these little workout clothes from GP Sticker Studio on top of, oh, I was going to do it on top of the pizza. Well, crud. Let me see if the whites will cover it up. No. Oh, shoot. That'll be fine. All right, and after that, what did I want to mark? Um, I might mark that I tanned separate. I want to mark my steps. And I pulled these, um... Cute little tennis shoes from the planning world. Let me see. I already have that. But I want something kind of small. Maybe I'll just do this arrow. I was watching Designated Survivor, which is really good. I'm going to pull this quarter box in from, no, let me use a darker pink, from um, Scribble Prints Go. I love these boxes. I've got this little TV. This looks like a, um, a Scribble Prints Go TV, but I did get it from my leftover sticker book. Okay, I did have to adjust the icons to swap their sides. I don't know if this is me getting, I think this is me getting liquid paper on these. White out. I haven't called it liquid paper in a while. But I'm going to mark um, that I put some new contacts in. And I got some cute little contact icons from my friend Susie. Thank you so much. They're so cute. And these are from the Fox and Pip. Oh, and they needed it so bad. My eyes were so dry that um, I was in a meeting and I rubbed my eyes because they were itching from the dry contacts. And, um, I'm trying to see what I was gonna mark. Anyway, the contact literally popped out. All right. I think I'm going to start with putting this on maybe one of these longer flags that came with the kit. Because I had a late start this day. I don't know how much space I'll need. Let's see, I'm gonna cut the pizza off. But I had a late start, like I woke up late on Thursday. And Landry has a live class connect Thursday at nine. So I didn't have time to get ready and be at work 
in time for her to be on that Class Connect at 9, so she had to do it from here, which means we couldn't leave here until like 9.30, um, and I was just, I don't know, running behind. This is the morning I was actually shopping for Planning World, I do remember it, um, because I was running late. Anyway, when I was on my way to work, um, they called to ask me, they, because we had two doctors there that day. So they called to see if, okay, I've got to see what I'm marking next before I start talking again. All right, it's only a half box for that. Um, but they said that um, the doctor needed my office. And so I said, well, if the doctor's going to be, the, of course they can, but if they're going to be in my office, I'm just going to work from home. Alright, here's another, here's a pink half box, so I'm going to use this, because once I decided to work from home, um, Landry and I went shopping because I needed to get some cardstock paper. I was printing some dashboards for my friend, and I, I had some from Planner Press, but I ran out, so I wanted to go to Hobby Lobby, but... I found some really good cardstock at Walmart, which is where we went. It looks like there's a glare. I hope it's not too bad. I think the other thing I'll mark is my Happy Mail for the week. Um, is it okay that it's going that way? Let me put a flag under it. I'll just center it. I'm trying to think how much, so I'll know how much space I need. But I'm going to put this little mailbox, um, which is from Tickled Pink Planner, I believe, and it's also a gift. Um, was in some Happy Mail that Susie sent me, so I'm going to list my Happy Mail for that day. Okay, so Friday is Valentine's Day. Let me put in my where is it happy valentine's day hopefully it's not going to be too big for that box yeah perfect all right so we'll put that like that very good Okay, so Friday was Valentine's Day, and I was feeling kind of blah, so on the way to work, let's see. a cute cupcake. I was really wanting to use it. Um, let me just see. Yeah. So I started my day with Sorry, maybe I won't put that in the box. Maybe I'll put this on a flag. And I'll put it on this side. But I stopped at McDonald's um, because it was, like I said, one of those days I had got, got up early and put Landry's like bag together. So, so I got her like a stuffed elephant and a bag of candy. Of course.
And then Stacy sent me some roses and her some roses and balloons. But I ate McDonald's on the way to work. And then when I got to work, Ryan had got us, had got us, got us a cupcake. And I started my day with a really awesome, rich chocolate cupcake from um, Buttercups. Sorry, I had to write that in to see how that was going to look. I was worried that wasn't going to fit. I need to, um... I don't know, figure out my words. Um, I need to get a thinner pen. That one's a little too fat. Alright, let me sit this pumpkin down here on this line. So, yeah, I started my day with... Uh, crap and I felt like I didn't feel good all day because of it so I'm gonna put this box here and these roses and they do kind of go into Saturday I won't push down right there in case I need to I don't know what that means. Like, I didn't get them from work, but I got them delivered to work. And, you know, that, like, just makes it a little bit more special. What else did I want to mark for Friday? Um, that it was so cold. That's right. I was going to mark. It was so cold Friday. Um, so, we decided to go to the Mardi Gras Parade on Saturday. And I'm not sure why everything happened kind of last minute. Because, um... Let's see. I need to pull in some of the black and white. But I'm not sure why we waited to the last minute. But we did there was there was one on this this weekend. Um, and then there's which is the crew of Centaur, and then there is one next week this weekend that i'm in right now um that is the the crew of gemini so i think we were kind of thinking we were going to go to the one on um um next saturday but one of the girls that went with us who had not who's from new jersey from New Jersey and had never been to a Mardi Gras parade. Um, sorry, she couldn't go next weekend. So we decided, okay, well, we'll go this weekend so that um, she can go. I can't think and decorate at the same time. But anyway, Friday we needed to get some supplies, but Stacy really took care of most of it, to be honest. I have stickers all over my hand. My hands look like crap because they're dry and I got white out all over them. put this at the top here for Saturday and I got this fan at fantastic I love this saying I say this all the time that made it kind of hard to read by putting it on that but the parade was this day and I really didn't have anything to mark the parade but it is about 
drinking, eating, and then of course catching beads. If you have not been to a parade, you sh a Mardi Gras parade, you should do yourself a favor and go because it is a lot of fun. Um, now, I live in North Louisiana, not South Louisiana, so I'm not talking about the New Orleans Mardi Gras. That might be kind of rough. I have heard it is and that it's like really overcrowded. But where I'm at, just trying to see where to put this because I want to layer these balloons with it. I found my foiled balloons. Um... But in North Louisiana, where I'm at, it is, um, it, it's, it's not like that. It's fun. It's still, it's wild, but, um, not like you're scared wild. I mean, there are some people, of course, that fight because there's so much alcohol involved, but, you know, there are family areas, so you can sit in designated family areas where there is no, where there's not supposed to be any drinking, um, we don't because, of course, we like to drink, um, have some beer while we're there. Um, let's see. Since I have, let me pull in one of these. I don't have room for that one. But it's kind of like a tailgate party. So you set up, you know, you set your area up and we grill, have hot dogs and like I said, beer um, or whatever you want to bring. But we had a whole table of stuff set up and so you eat and everybody's listening to music. But it's, it's like you can hear your own music, but it, you don't really hear other people's. Um, because it's outside. I'm probably just rambling and not making a lot of sense. But, oh, no, no. Definitely would rather mark this. Um, anyway, then when the parade starts, because the parade only goes past you for, I don't know, 30 or 45 minutes. Um, so most of the fun is the, the, um, atmosphere leading up to the parade. But it's fun, and we catch so many, I'm like, I caught like 30 cups, which is my favorite thing to catch. And we always catch a lot of beads, and then we, you know, we come home and do absolutely nothing with them, so. See what I want to mark for Sunday that it was a lazy day. Um, did I not pull a lazy day sticker? Maybe this coffee. Let's see. Let me put this on a little flag. Okay, I'm just going to put that there. And then, and then, I want to mark that I helped Stacy type his grievance. Um, he had a grievance that he was filing, and oh my gosh, he was so extremely passionate about it that it literally took three hours. And he like wanted to recite it to me rather than me just looking at the page and typing it. 
and he was reciting it with like the same passion he wrote it with you know like all the anger was coming back so he was like shouting it was wild um and then you know he'd be like oh i forgot to add this and so i'd have to type it again print it again you know add to it then print it again um crazy crazy uh, his grievance was so long that um, he literally had an outline for it. All right. I also want to mark that Lantry slept with me this night, which is nice. I always sleep really good when she sleeps with me. And we watched The Secret Life of Pets, part two. Yeah, part two, um, which puts her to sleep. I don't like that popcorn, so I'm going to pull a different popcorn icon um, to put there. And that's about all the room I'm going to have. I, I was going to say, on our way back from the Mardi Gras parade, uh, we did stop at Dairy Queen and get a blizzard. I didn't get one because I didn't want one because blizzard doesn't really mix well with beer. But Landry and Stacy went to one, so they got one. Uh, so let me fill all this out, and we'll see how it looks all filled in. I'm back with the final spread all filled in. I uh, did change the date covers. They were not working at all with this spread. So I, and I did not have any pink date covers with a gold foil. All the stickers I have, I couldn't believe that. Tons of silver, but no gold. So I just pulled in this washi from Simply Gilded. Laid that down for the date covers. Used some Days of the Week scripts from Paper and Prints. Um, they are not sticking worth a shit. I don't know if it's because it's on washi or if it's because the stickers are over a year old. And I laid down some more date dots from Adorably Amy Design. So here is the foil shot. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you have a great week. Bye.